Hello YouTube viewers and subscribers Today I have a new flight controller It's from Holybro company called Kakute F7 I'm sorry And it's one of the best flight controllers at the market today As you can see it comes well packed with this sticker so you can be sure it, it hasn't been opened yet and let's see what's in the box let me clean this up very nice protected and in in the sponge of course so you can be sure that this board will come protected okay this is it viewers let me turn it around like this so you can see so it is a little bit bigger board than usual because of this powerful processor which is uh, actually one of the most powerful flight controller processor on on the market so when you are building your quadcopter uh, take care because it is 35 by 4 35 millimeters wide and 48 48 millimeters in length you can see here this is the gyro which is mounted on uh, anti-vibration sponge and that's good so you, you can be sure that your gyro will be separated from any vibration vibrations made by propellers motors frame or anything else um, in the box you receive another connection cable and another anti-vibration sponge just in case and some stickers with holy bro logo and name that's not interested for, interesting for me right now so okay why is this board so special first of all this is uh, probably as I mentioned before, one of the strongest microprocessors on the market for for the flight controllers. It has uh, seven UAR UAR or I don't know how you call UARTs, uh, but six of them are completely independent. It has, uh, as you can see here, current sensor with up to 130 amps. It has a barometer inside also, so you can use it for uh, see actual height of the model. It supports SBUS, SmartPort and other protocols on any UART, any UART. And serial receivers, of course, SBUS, IBUS, Spectrum, Crossfire only. You cannot use PPM and PWM receivers they are not supported only serial ones uh, on the other side you can see tf card slot for black box uh, mounting holes are standard 30.5 square millimeters for mounting on your on your uh, quadcopter frame supports beta flight Butterfly, Clean Flight, iNav. I mean, this processor is actually really, really powerful. Beta Flight OSD, that's normal. Uh, and also, it has SCL SDA pads for external 
GPS or maybe ma magnetometer. So in the maybe in the future releases, I know the beta fight is working something with uh, with uh, GP using the GPS and return to home function. So for the future future usage, this is it. You can add GPS for this board too. Bootloader button if you want to change firmware or use you know what uh, input is from 7 volts to 42 volts so it means to up to 6s batteries and it has a filtered voltage output for other components like VTX and and camera and whatever you need I don't know if you can see oh I turned it around maybe if I put it a little bit closer you can see something I mean it's all documented you have 5 volt output for camera anything you need so why this board is one of the best of the on the market it's actually as I mentioned premium one with uh, all necessary things you might need uh, you have to be careful because of the size of course as I mentioned in the beginning it will not be good for some tight fits on, on the smaller quadcopters but it's actually what can I say future proof board I mean now it's beta flight 3.4 3.3 I don't know 3.4 la latest version but you can be sure that when beta flight 4 beta flight 5 comes out this strong microprocessor will be able to manage that that is why this board is a little bit bigger because of that strong microprocessor um, did I mention that you can use INAV of course if you want to use it on some planes or flying wings uh, so all in all this board as I mentioned is future proof if you purchase this you can be sure that all further upgrades will be available for this board and it's just strong microprocessor that makes it possible you cannot miss with this board except the only thing you have to take care of is the size if the size doesn't fit you then maybe you can use uh, Kakute F4 but if size is not a, an issue for you this is premium board well made high quality and you just cannot miss anything with this okay did I mention that it's all in one I think I did so you have various outputs for uh, battery VTX uh, cameras whatever excellent board I'm just thrilled to see it on my quadcopter flying you can use a lot of filters anti-vibration filters again this is powerful powerful processor and that is why it's in such a high class board okay thanks for watching and see you next time bye